going to do whoops, a quick what's in bloom, well as quick as possible. Because I got a lot of stuff and spiking and bud. I got these little hangers here from uh, Amazon. I've seen them on eBay. And they seem to be working well. I need to drill holes in the bottom though. <clears throat> Figured I can rotate them out when they're in bloom, put them over here, and when they're not, move them back to where I keep my other orchids. So here is Sherry Baby. I put her where the fan will help blow the fragrance around. Really pretty, one of my favorites by far. Then over here, I have a Cymbidium Butterball, I believe. Really pretty, love her. Up here is Cymbidium Peter's Fire Porch. Kind of high up, so I'm doing my best to get it. And then over here, this is Anna Maria, I believe. Let's see. Nope, wasn't even close. Well, Valerie, that's still not close, no. But um, that one's really pretty. The spike came out kind of wonky. That was my fault. This whole situation still needs some... Still needs some work. I just barely touched it and messed the whole thing up. Oh well. There we go. Kinda fixed it. Sort of. I don't know. Uh, this guy's in spike. They gave this to me 50% off and I was like, well you know it's got lots of spikes on it. They didn't care. So, oh, that dog. It's a Miltasa. Okay. And over here, I love this. I think this is Miltonia Rockhurst, I believe. Or, uh, Miltasa. I think so. At a foul from Hauserman. Don't remember which one. This is Rescue from Trader Joe's. I'm happy with these fowls from Hauserman. They haven't bloomed for me yet, and the color's nice. So let's see what else. Okay, and then up here in Spike is my Rinkeroides Bangkok Sunset crossed with Vanda Willis. Can't wait to see what that looks like. Here is a cat Leia that's just now going out. I think this is BLC Sunspots, maybe? Don't remember. And I've lost a lot of tags because of storms and whatnot. Um, Asco Phoenicia. Oh, one spike and bloom on it. I really like the flowers. They're very small and dainty. This is a uh, cross between Neo Phoenicia Falcata. And it's got a mini atom super. Some of my Fred Clark is that do not like being outside. This is Phalaenopsis Sogoberry. Another Hauserman fowl. If you want the names to some of these fowls, let me know and I'll find the tags. I have them. They're just not here right now. This is one of my favorites. BLC. Probably Leila Catlia. YNI Leopard Chinghua. Hasn't bloomed for me in two years, so I was really happy to see this bloom for me this year. This is Grepito. Hmm. Guess I didn't prep for this video very well, did I? Uh huh. Okay. It's this one. It's a Zygopetalum cross. And. Surprisingly not fragrant, which is the main reason I got it. And then waited months for it to bloom, and that's okay. They're still really pretty. Really pretty flowers, just not not very fragrant. Back here I have another Miltas and it's going out of bloom. Yep, can't really see those. Um, and then my Epidendrum. Radicans. I have a little pink one over here that's just gone out of bloom. Lots of my air plants are, well, <laughs> going out of bloom. I think that's everything I have right now. 
Yep, that's all. I was getting concerned because here we are July and I didn't have anything on spike and then like three weeks ago everything just exploded. This sherry baby back here has tons of buds on it. It's taking its time to open. So now hopefully the next thing will be that the van does open for me because I have tons of them. And most of them aren't doing anything right now, which is weird. Usually in July I have several in bloom. Oh well. Happy gardening everybody.